Hey everybody, welcome back to another part of Let's Play Valiant Heart the Great War. In the previous part, we um, beat Baron from Von Grumble, or something like that, and Freddy decided to spare his life. And then we found out that Carl was on his way back home to his wife and kid, but he has to be sneaky. So now we're going to see if this disguise works. Alright, we can go that way. Sure, fire. Fair enough. Okay. Bye. <laughs> I'm guessing we still have to hide from, from the French authorities. Alright, so there doesn't seem to be anything over there. Let's continue walking. Through the snow. Exhausted. Starving. Carl realized he'd never reach Sanier. His strength fading. Destiny still had one more surprise in store. They were only about 20 miles from San Miel when their hopes were again dashed. Really, a flat tire. <laughs> um, anyone? Can someone tell? Alright, we need a passport to get past there. Okay. And that's only only French soldiers are allowed in there. You need a wheel. Oh, what's wrong, puppy? So let's see if we can dig. See if we can get something useful. Um, what's that? French Gendarmes cap? Gendarmes cap? The French somethings also operated as military police. Somethings <laughs> made sure soldiers respected military law and behaved themselves at the front. Okay, we need something um, to throw the left. Only French soldiers. Alright, but I need something to throw. Can't we make a snowball? Or would that be too obvious? Ah! Alright. Okay, okay, okay. So we need to get that outfit first. Shut up, puppy. All right, we're not supposed to do that. But how are we supposed to get that outfit then? Doesn't seem like the puppy can help us. Oh wait, he seems to turn around every now and then. Oh. All right. So we have to wait for him to turn around and then just hurry. Oh. Never mind. Um. I don't think we're supposed to go up there. So let's try to sneak past this, that guy first. Grab that puppy. Thank you, puppy. <sighs> All right. Now you should be able to get up here. A sack of bran. Wheat was rare, so cereals were used to make flour for bread. Uh, wheat bran is darker than compost and components mainly of fiber, but also crammed with vitamins and minerals. Today it's an integral part of high fiber diets. Back in the day, it was a sign of hard times. It's funny how times change. So, is there anything over here? Oh, we're here! Alright. Alright, so I guess there's something down there in the jail area. Oh, I hope the puppy didn't get into too much trouble. What are they going to do? Throw him in jail? Am I right? So, we now can enter this. Ready? All that for a French emergency banknote? 
The French National Bank struggled to produce enough coins and banknotes, so emergency money was produced. Local authorities were permitted to draw up their own banknotes with their own design. Kind of cool. Kind of cool. But really, all that for just a collectible. Alright, so let's go find out what we can do. Alright, 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 alright. So, can we get to the wine now? Well, screw you too. I have a half a mind to call you something. Ah, oh, I see only French uh, soldiers or police officers, I guess. All right, let's change into a soldier's uh, uniform. And... I just got a call, so I have to call back. So I'm sorry for this, but I will um, see you guys in a second. Okay, we're back. Sorry about that, but I had to uh, make that call. Because reasons. And now we are dress dressed like a French uh, soldier. But what we can do, I have no idea. Alright, you want wine. Fair enough. I would want to drink as well, if I were in your situation. So... Alright, before we do that... I like how they just watch me throw that bottle of wine. Oh, there was an alternative way to get the French. Um, uniform. Alright. Good thing to know, I guess. If you're playing with me. Or... What? B Alright. Alright, I get it. I get it. So we need to um, change a couple of times. Can we change like this? Nope. There we go. So we have to do this now. Can we get past him now with the wine? Alright. And now we have to go back up here and change again. Uh, change. Wrong way. Thank you. Alright. And now we can bring the wine to our friend upstairs. Dude, I have your wine. Uh. Hey, Bitch. Murder! Uh, you weenie. Oh, that's collectible. Postcard. A postcard of a luscious woman sent to a soldier at the front. Such postcards were popular among troops. That's... Um, something I don't have any difficulty believing. Uh, but other than that postcard. Was there... I have the feeling we can do something with this chest, but... Aha! Can we now do something with... No, we can't. Oh! Hell yeah! <laughs> Salute me! I like this. I also like how they only look at your uniform instead of also your face because I I would imagine that that they would know the face of their commanding officer but uh apparently not and suddenly the wine stains are gone as well 
Uh oh. Did he just? All right. Oh balls. Come on, stop shooting. There we go. Blow up. Uh. Alright. So while well, listening to Flight of the Bumblebees. What the, what the crap? Please don't. Did we do it? Oh crap, we didn't do it. There we go, we did it. Alright, so our cards are competing. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, I did it again. Can we... Oh, we're not safe here. We're not safe here at all. There we go. Oh, of course it's not broken yet. Oh, of course it's not. Oh, crap. All right, I can do this. Just focus. Oh, balls! Oh, balls! Oh, balls! Um, ah, balls. No, you don't. What do you think you're doing? Holy crap, man. This is kind of excessive, don't you think? All I did was steal your uniform. Ah, oh, oh, crap. Alright. Back to this. There we go. Ah, oh, balls. We got hit. We got hit anyway. Oh man, this is kind of hard, actually. No you don't. Stay away from me. You stay away from me. Um, what? What the crap are you doing, man? Dramatic music. It's kind of fitting, actually. <laughs> fuzzy. I don't know what she's saying. It sounds like fuzzy. Again. Come on, just let me throw a dynamite at you. You moron. Sadly, I can only throw dynamite straight behind me. Oh! Crap, that took me a while to see, but I finally saw it. Oh crap. Almost got me. Oh. Dude, dude. Oh boy. So this part is going to run a little bit long. Sorry for that. But hopefully you understand. I just want to get past this. Oh. Alright, he's coming back now. And again with with the shooty thingies. No, not again with the barrels. And that's quite the dry fur. And more barrels. No, 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 oh, crap. Come on. 
Oh crap. This shouldn't be so hard. Why is this so hard? Why is that little French guy so vind vindictive? Little French guy! Why are you so vindictive? So now it's going to break again. There we go. Oh man. Chapter 4, Wooden Crosses. Their euphoria was short-lived, intercepted by German troops who still held San Miel. Carl and Anna were led to the officers' quarters for interrogation. Carl was sent back to fight for the Germans, while Anna was sent to the infirmary to care for soldiers. On April 8th, the French forces launched an assault on San Miel, an opportunity that Carl would not let slip by. Still wearing the French uniform. All right, but that's going to be it for this time. So thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys later. Goodbye.